welcome Sats Busters to question 18. And we've got a vegetable garden. It shows the fractions of the garden planted with potatoes and cabbages. The remaining area is planted with carrots. And we've got to work out what that remaining area is. Now, a massive hint coming up. On your arithmetic paper, whenever you've got fractions with different denominators, you're always encouraged to make the denominators the same first. So make some equivalent fractions where the denominators are the same. And it's exactly the same here. So we need equivalent fractions where the denominators are the same for two thirds and a quarter. So we need a common denominator for thirds and quarters. Common denominator for thirds and quarters is twelfths. So we're going to turn both of these into twelfths. So to get from 3 to 12, we're times that by 4. So we need to times it 2 by 4 as well. 2 times 4 is 8, so that's 8 twelfths. And to get from 4 to 12 is times 3. So we need to times the 1 by 3 as well. 1 times 3 is 3. So we're basically dealing with 8 twelfths of potatoes and 3 twelfths is cabbages. So potatoes, let's just say that again. The potatoes is 8 twelfths, cabbages is 3 twelfths and you can probably see what's going to happen here carrots is the rest of it well the remaining area to make it up to the whole garden now the whole garden would be 12 twelfths so that's worth remembering as well the whole garden is 12 twelfths so 8 twelfths and 3 twelfths is 11 twelfths so we just need to have one more twelfth for carrots and that will get us up to the twelve twelfths to make the whole garden. So carrots, final answer for carrots is one twelfth. But yeah, you've got to remember that questions which can be put on arithmetic papers can easily be adapted to appear on reasoning papers as well. So if the question on the arithmetic paper was what's two thirds add one quarter, you would more than likely find your common denominator of 12 and come out with 8 twelfths plus 3 twelfths is 11 twelfths. It's the same sort of thing here. 8 twelfths and 3 twelfths is 11 twelfths. So the rest of it to make it up to a whole one is 1 twelfth, whole garden. So just remember to watch out for that.